This is BizBeat. I'm Zhu Jufeng. 10.76 million college graduates will be seeking jobs this year in China, the biggest number on record. This number comes against the backdrop of National Statistics Bureau data, which pegged the jobless rate of people aged between 16 and 24 in the country at 18.2 percent in April. To understand these numbers, let's look at the supply and demand data of graduates in China's job market. On the supply side, the number of college graduates was 8.7 million and 9.1 million in 2020 and 2021. Many of them had to delay their employment due to the pandemic. And three years ago, Chinese colleges expanded their enrollment by 1 million students, many of whom are graduating this year. Moreover, hundreds of thousands of students are estimated to have cancelled their plans for overseas studies and work, and have instead chosen to seek domestic jobs, putting additional strain on the country's labour market. And on the demand side, the pandemic in the past three years has hurt employers' profits and reduced the appetite for new workers. Good news is that the government has accorded top priority to employment. Several times during this year, Chinese Premier Li Keqiang has reiterated the government's resolve to stabilize employment, including steps to help market entities tide over difficulties, promoting services to key job hunting groups such as college graduates, and carrying out vocational training. Things are looking up now as Beijing and Shanghai are returning to full normalcy, while investments in infrastructure projects have risen. Along with more loans and tax cuts to small companies, who are the biggest job creators in China, so experts predict young people's employment prospects will improve in the second half of this year. Graduates also need to do their part. Most of the 2020 graduates are the post-2000 generation, born into a booming China. Many of them are the only child of an over-caring family, so some may be shocked to find that. A college degree is a job guarantee. Notion is no longer relevant. They also find that many jobs that the government and small companies offer may not be exactly the fancy ones. They could be community workers, caretakers, preschool teachers, live streamers for farm produce, construction workers, or freelancers. Many of these jobs are what the country and society needs. A journey of a thousand miles starts from a humble step. A professional career can last 40, 50, or 60 years, and starting on a modest note is not necessarily a bad thing, as hardship at an early age often lays the foundation for later build-ups. After all, in 20 years, these graduates will be strong enough to become the pillar of China.